Hey guys, welcome to the Mortuary Assistant. I had some people asking me to play this the full game, so I figured to give it a shot. Um, starting out from the beginning, I guess. All right. Now, does it pick up where the demo left off? Well, I hope not, because didn't I die? Uh, okay. I'm so glad it's 1998. Awesome. Congratulations, sweetie. <laughs> Thank you. Connecticut. I'll never understand why you chose such a macabre field. There's nothing but... disturbing Let's about see. it. It's just but that I... I'm proud of you. I really am. You've come so far. So, you haven't told me what's next. Will you get a job where you are, or...? They actually have everyone they need. But my old teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to finalize my internship there. Uh-huh. Oh, well, that's good. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? <laughs> no. No, I'm not moving. He's actually located around here. River Fields. Oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma. Even I've heard things about that place. Well, thanks. Just be worried people about you. People make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. Right, right. Ghost body? What, what Sorry. does ghost body mean? But I wanted to give you this anyway. So. A uh, murder victim or something? Here. That what it means? Or what are ghosts? Oh. I, I don't know if I want that. Just take it, please. Why? It should be yours anyway. Why do I have an issue with that? Okay, why is this so tense Thanks. over a necklace? All right, enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When do you start? I've actually been there for a few weeks now. My review is tomorrow. Maybe the place is burning down and we go to work now? That'd be nice. Probably not, though. Or otherwise, we get a nice, uh, thanks for playing screen. Okay. At least it's not raining and storming this time. All right. Here we go. All right. Go again. Hey! Oh no, I'm never gonna get this back in there again. Am I? Oh god. I did it again. No. Okay, that's where it belongs. Uh, business cards. Cool. Oh, from that angle, it looks like you can see her eyes. They get really close. That's weird. Creepy. All right. Uh, Rebecca, one last thing. I'm, I'm proud to give to you. I'm proud to give to you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign. Thanks. Zoe, P.S. Good luck. I hate when people say good luck at a job. It makes me wonder why it is do I need luck for the job? <laughs> Okay, look at the desk. Why am I signing a pencil? Oh, Jesus. Uh, back. Uh, right click. All right. What was that? We may follow me. Oh. Music's changed. Oh, God. Rebecca, great, perfect timing. I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. Okay. Okay, fine. All right. Uh, hey, buddy. Oh, I get to look at you. 
Oh, I don't like this. Why is it so hard to look away? Is it really? There we go. When you these things are very unwieldy, or very wieldy. Come on. There we go. At least they didn't change the controls too much. It's still the same from the demo. I need to use this thing. Can we use this thing? Oh, there we go. All right. Uh, get in there. Go on. Get in there. Oh, come on. There we go. Nope. Go. Go in your home. Why is it? Okay, can't, maybe this thing's in the way. There we go. Oswald. Dalton. Hey, Dorothy. Where's Toto? You, you look, if I remember, you look a little bit different. Oh, God. Oh, her eyes are open. Please don't blink. I don't want you to blink. Don't blink. Don't blink. Don't blink. Don't blink. What's on your cheek? Oh. Oh, there's one on her foot, too. What'd you die of? Do I need to be wearing a mask or something? Oh, she jiggled. Oh, the feet jiggle. All right. I'm just finishing <laughs> up something here. So why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks? I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. What was that first to see for? Let's just close this. Or not. Dorothy Page, 87. How you doing, Dorothy? Well, it's just a stupid question. Never mind. Why is that smoking? Right here on the foot. What? Hmm. These old windows never stay latched. Uh huh. I played the demo. I know you're full fit. Can we close our eyes? I open it back up. <clears throat> oh. Alright, maybe I, should, I didn't check her other hand. Hold on. Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Don't forget to take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that. We'll get started. Okay. Alright, so this this looks like it's the same. Okay. You'll die here. What I'm was that? sorry. I didn't say anything. You alright? Yeah. I'm fine. Sorry. I'm pretty sure I heard it say you'll die here. Right arm. Right leg. A uh, hamanga oma? Himenga. Okay. Left uh, arm. And uh, the head. The right 
head, shoulder, arm. Yes. Right leg. Okay. Oh. Age is 87. Okay, cool. Hi. No, just take it up front. Oh. oh. Okay, it's just showing me where to go, right? It's not like a ghost path, right? Time to embalm. Sounds like fun. All right. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Everything's on your list there if you need it. Oh, cool. That's helpful. What was that noise? I heard something else. Moisturizing. I got a wiper. Why are jaw... Oh, that's new. Why are jaws shut with needle injector? And setting needles. Needle injector. For hammering setting needles into the skull. Setting needles. Insert eye caps. Oh, that's why your eyes are open. Okay. I'm missing something. Wait, where did the, where did my I just had it? I mean, I, I was literally looking at. It. Oh, I dropped it. Oh, how did I drop it? Okay. Oh. How do I? Okay. Placing eye caps. Hey, she's winking at you. Okay. All right. Okay, now what? Oh, the chemicals. That's a gluey whatever. Methanol. What the? Hmm. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly. And it can make them pop like that. Just keep doing your thing. I'll get it. I don't trust you. Maldehyde. Whatever. Wait, what? And blue to right. Oh, I didn't. I, that's why I'm doing. I'm not hitting E on it. Okay. All right. Now I need scalpel. If I remember right. Don't know what this is for. We'll take the. Oh, the already forceps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tubing will need that. I don't know what that's for. Oh, that's what happened. This stuff popped. Oh. Oh, I'm going over here. I can't use that here. Okay. Ah. 
Okay. Uh. Oh, that's the same. Why are you just scaring me? This is creepy. <laughs> oh, there's actually there's stitches there this time though. That's a nice touch. Okay, now we gotta do the Yeah. I would never do this job. I don't think there's enough money in the world. Well there's probably enough money in the world. <laughs> I would never Intentionally go out looking for this job. There we go. Yay, we did it. What is this? What? Oh, mix cleaners in the bathroom closet. Oh, okay. Okay. You know, you still didn't clean this stuff up. You just said you would. Uh, apply moisturizer. Okay. Oh, I gotta wait for that. Okay. <clears throat> All right, moisturize. Move the wipe around the facial while holding down interact. Oh! Tell you what. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Uh, are you sure? I just got here. Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. It's fine. I'll give you a call when we get someone in. What? Go ahead, we'll... Who's he talking to? Okay. That was just a tutorial and it scared the crap out of me more than once. Mainly because he was there. I wasn't expecting that. It was just really weird. So some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. No, I know. It, it wasn't even my fault, but he sent me home right after that. Oh. I'm just really worried. He was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said he would, right? Yeah. So, that's a good thing. Yeah, it just didn't feel like he meant it. Like, like he just said it to get me out of the building. Uh, wait a sec, I have another call. Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. Okay. That's uh, actually why I'm calling. I know it's late, but we just got three new cadavers, and no one else can make it in right now. Three? 
three now. I was hoping you could come in and take care of them. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I mean, of course. <laughs> Excellent. You're doing me a huge favor. I took care of the rest of your onboarding. We're all set. And your new badge is in your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. <gasps> see? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. I have to go. Like, right now. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Uh, where are my keys? I just realized something. Where do I sleep? I'm assuming that's probably the bathroom. Do I sleep on the couch? Oh, that was easy. Take a knife with me to work. That's what I do. Donut stuff. Happy tofu. No, no, it's not happy tofu. There's no such thing as happy tofu. Alright. Let's get to work. So, will this first night... Is it more than one night or is it just one, one night? I don't know. I know if, if it's anything like the demo, but there's only one night. But I'm assuming it's probably gonna be longer than that. Over here. One, oh, it's the rain. Yeah, okay. This is the back door. Oh, I can go all the way around this. What? Oh, it's the desk light. I just don't remember it being red. and get started yep okay sounds like a plan this is, what what happened what i miss what hello hi rebecca M mr delver i need help someone's outside the mortuary just Try to stay calm. I know you're scared. I'll unlock the door in a moment. What? This is very sudden, but listen to me. We have to start right away. I'm sorry. I didn't know until it made itself known this morning that it was here, let alone bound to you. What? I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. I'll just leave. I'll, I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm. Okay? Okay. We bomb, file the paperwork, everything. Treat it like a normal day. Staying focused will help. I left some things for you on the desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. No, wait. Oh, damn it. What the fuck? This is insane. A little bit. It's in the box. Okay. This is so stupid. It's just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just... Just play along and do your job. Yeah, sure. Oh, okay. Old key, old key. Okay. Matchbox, one left. That might be important. 
Oh no no leave that one. Uh hall. I'm fucking quitting tomorrow. I mean who does something like this? Crazy man. You hang out next to the window here too? I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, but I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, you will need to learn the demon's name, bind it to its chosen body, and burn it in the retort. Uh. Look, I know this is a lot to take in. I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. Okay. I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that having a physical object with a known message will help you stay grounded. I won't be calling again. You can't trust the phones. Anything can be manipulated. Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. The most important thing in the room is in that cabinet. Open it up. Good luck, Rebecca. I'm sorry this had to happen. This is insane. Whatever. Just be the professional one, grab a body, and get started. Okay. All right, let's listen to the first tape. Night shift system. The night shift database. Program combining all my findings into one Just reference grab point. A body. The database contains all the information on the process of expulsion, the tools used, and most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. You will need this information. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Use it. Okay. Oh, I can't actually take that. Okay. What is this, though? The Book of Typhon? 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 Uh. Six Typhon walked among his disciples and he spoke. He who does not truly let the Lord into his heart shall be judged by his sin and destined to serve those who truly believe. For all are assigned to the halls of hell. Seven abandoned God as he was abandoned you. Bring Lucifer into your heart and <laughs> what the hell is this? Into your heart and reveal revel in his glorious sin, for all all are damned. There is no hope of God. All are marked for the houses of hell as all hopelessly lost. You've been left behind. And he, as he passed I have a, how long is this? Just okay. Um as he passed one ren? One ren? One ren. Looked upon Typhoon with disgust and said, I will not turn my eye from God. Satan has no... Why is this one lowercase and all the rest are capital? Anyway, Satan has no dominion over the Lord's creation. Typhoon looked unto Onran. Onran? I don't know. <laughs> and said, pray as you wish. Fold your knees at this moment and call to God. Perhaps today he will step down from heaven and all doubt shall vanish. Pray to nothing and behold the truth. I will take from your God's creation the ashes of man, for it burns eternal and sinful fire. Typhon held the charred remains of D-Rod and walked among his disciples, spreading ash upon their flesh. Oh, yeah, this give me hints to their names. Typhon. One ran. D-Rod. Walked among his disciples, spreading his ash. And it's like hint, like ash. Ash upon their flesh, setting the reeds in his hand ablaze. He said to one ran, see now that all are marked in the glory of Satan. One ran beheld, the, of, beheld a flash of light upon the skin of each disciple as Typhon passed from it. He saw a mark burn deep into their flesh. One of three for houses of hell, for we all are destined to serve his higher purpose. And Typhon extended the ashes of D-Rod to the hands of one ran and said, Bear the forgotten flesh upon your own, ignite its sin, accept the true God. 
All right, so there's what? One, two, three. I doubt it's going to be Lucifer. I found one, two, three. Okay, so there's like three names? Wait, I got a old key. Yeah, screw all of whatever this is. I'm getting back to work. No, go away. I don't want you. What's this one say? All right, this one's three. Where's two? Is this two? Two, okay. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. Three? First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder and burn, you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They can be anywhere, so look on walls, under objects, inside furniture. Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them, so check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with, and use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. Add the reagent to the embalming mixture, uncover the sigils, build the mark and place it on the body. Then, when you're certain, burn it in the retort. Okay. This doesn't sound too hard. I'm famous last words, I'm sure. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you, until you are unable to resist. Identifying a demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Okay. Look carefully. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. I hope this time where I'm trying to learn everything isn't going against me. Okay. Well, can I do this now? Oh! All right, so we have a Z already. Have my clipboard. Oh, where is my clipboard? At least I can keep track of things. Let's hope. Is 
So who's our first uh, patient? Faye. Faye Haley. Okay, you're much younger. I was expecting them all these old people. I guess, you know, funerals, they don't always be young, old. Crummy old building. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Old wiring. Fuck me in here. Scare the shit out of me. So do the bodies do something that let me know that's them? There's a again. All right, let's check you out. You don't look too good. Okay, and I'm really paranoid like this. <laughs> Ironic. Hello? Nope, nope. New job. I'm getting out of here. I'm with her. How long are we to school? New career path. Fuck this. Yep. No. Maybe everything's fine. It's it's fine. Uh, what? No, I, I you're just you're just as much as I'm just saying things. I just need to get back to work. It's it's fine. Okay. Let's go. Oh. Okay, I think we're okay. Okay. That was weird. Scratches. Probably okay. I can't click it from here. Okay. There we go. Okay. Um. What are we doing? What, who is she? What am I? Haley. Bay. Bay Haley. Okay. Oh, she's only 22. Oh, that's, that's young. Right arm. Left arm. Leg. Just four? Yeah, four. to file the copy up front. You gonna do anything? You stay there. Time to embalm. Oh, she probably burns more paper. Someone just walk past that window. So far we got a Z. Close my car's windshield reflection. Okay. No? Nothing? Really? 
Okay. Alright, so this one here's sat up. I don't know if that's enough to say that they're actually, you know, whatever. What is this? Wait, didn't he say there's a code or something like that on his badge? 1944? Oh, I can turn it. That's a long number. Okay, I'm gonna write that down. Does that may come in handy later? Or it could be for that keypad I just found. One, three, four, nine, one, three. Right, right there. Or it could be 1944 if it's only a four digit code. Raymond, I really need a key to the hatch outside. Cleaner is low, and you mentioned having some down there before. I know you don't trust anyone to go down there, but having a copy of the key would make things a lot easier for everyone. Zoe. Alright. Can, can I have I can't have those. Maya badge. Rebecca, Raymond asked me to take over restocking the rest of the supplies in the embalming room, so he's so secretive. I feel like I get different instructions every day. Sorry if it's not what you're used to. Zoe. P.S. Could you ask him to stop calling me Zoe? No one calls me that. Well, Raymond does. Why don't you just start calling him Ray? He'll love that. There you go. Ooh. An old large key. I'm sure I'll take that. Oh, I wonder where that goes to. All right, let's try this code. All right, so one, three, four, nine, three. All right, it was 1944. All right, so it's seven numbers. That thing is six numbers that I got. All right, so it's not that code. Oh, it's for something else. Any more? Just go quick run around. Then we'll start the embalming thing. Okay, we're good. All right, now we need to This I'll just do this a while. I can't. I can't do that early. All right. I don't, can I get rid of the paper? No. Okay. Well, I guess we're still okay. Um, what am I doing? Oh yeah, the scalpel. I need one of these things. What is this? Oh yeah, I need eyeball cap thingies too. Oh yeah, the oh. Hmm. This thing. Okay. Let me see those pearly teeth. Am I not doing it right? Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Okay. Can I do the eyes right away? All right. Let me see those peepers. Hello?
All right, uh, cut her neck open, I guess. I can't use that here. Oh, I gotta do the involving stuff first. Okay. No. Yes, I need the human stuff. Now, uh, is it over here? Oh, the glue. I guess we should go check what out that is. I'll get you soon, sir. Okay. Oh, what am I looking for? I'm menthol now, right? Yeah. Menthol. Did I put everything in it? Why did I put the reagent in it? I don't think she's it. I think I just spit on my monitor. <laughs> okay. Baleful. I don't want a door open to my back. And zip. I never picked up any tubing. Hold on. Tubing. Tubing. No, that's a personal stuff. Or. Is this tubing? Tubing. Yes. There you go, lady. Take care of this for you. weird This is not you. Okay, well that's weird. No stitches this time. I'm missing something. Oh yeah, I need the the pokey thingy. Trocar. Yeah, that's it. Well, thank you. Maybe we should burn some paper. So far, so good. I check the drawer room. Okay, so no new notes. All right, uh... Oh. 
So I'm guessing she's not a demon. Nothing weird happened. We're done now, right? Uh, mix clean. Oh, I gotta clean this stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah, and the moisturizing her face. Okay, yeah, because I'm a beauty salon now. <laughs> what? like that you're gonna be behind me oh what's this small photo 1970s back the year of arrival of the house of death the birth of his creator the full number shall be six okay uh, 1970 the year of arrival of the house of death the birth of this creator full number shall be six okay oh. okay so we got a we got a three, and we got a Z and a three. My night shift code. Okay. So this might be that one. One, three, four, nine, one, three. Oh, okay, we did it. All right. Oh, wow, this is a lot. Um. Oh, wow. Okay. But when the demonic entity is present, the vessel is occupying the form markings not previously observed. Oh! I can't move her around anymore. I don't see anything? Oh, I gotta open it first. Okay. April 17, 1944. I wonder if that would be the code of the keypad. Yeah. Uh, 4, 17, 1944. That'd be seven numbers. Try that. I move around yet? Oh, I'm I can. missing something. Oh. No. I gotta moisturize you then. Yeah. Uh, how do I. Okay, now I have a circle. That's probably a bad sign. Alright, so. 41719. Okay, so what if it's, uh. 17419. No. No, okay. Uh, where do I get my wipes at? Over here? No, they're not there. Where did they 
I think the wipes. I don't think I ever actually picked them up myself. They definitely weren't in the demo. Oh, what's that? Like? All right. Okay, nothing new there. That's the same. Feet look fine. Really long toes. Ah, okay, you're, you're good. You're a normal old uh, corpse, or client, or whatever you want to say. Just uh, stay there. That's all I ask. Way in there. There you go. Good night, uh, Faye. Okay. All right. That's all the time I have for this one. Uh, so we'll pick it up here again. Um. Wow. I was not expecting it to be so paranoid-inducing. And yeah. Anyway, I didn't know really the puzzles either. That's interesting. Cause like the the keypad underneath the in the door. But yeah. Anyway. Um. I'll be continuing this definitely. Um. I'll catch you on the next one, and I'll see you. Uh, I'll see you later. <laughs> Bye.